Hi, and welcome back. It's me, Martin. Now, I get a number of questions from viewers and subscribers about the material that I use when it comes down to online teaching. And in this video today, I'm here to answer that question. I have shared in the past the sort of structure and materials that I use for trial lessons, but post-trial is going to be kind of different. And I do hope that you enjoy this video. Now, before we continue, I, I should say a special thanks to everybody who has subscribed. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button just below and click the thumbs up. It really helps share this video around uh, a bit more. It helps the YouTube um, promote it and share it for those that may be interested. When it comes down to online teaching, there's a variety of materials that are available. In a face-to-face -face class, most teachers would end up using course books, and I've used course books quite regularly over the past 18, 19 years of teaching, which is great. It's a wonderful source for getting that springboard into your lessons. It helps have that structure and students know where you're starting and where you're going to be ending in the course book. However, with online lessons, it's slightly different. And particularly when you're teaching one-to-one, -one, there's going to be more emphasis on the conversation-driven approach, that interaction, that natural interaction. So you need to try and kind of approach online teaching quite differently to face-to-face -face teaching. Anyhow, um, before we continue, I'd like to have a special thanks to everybody who requested this video. Um, it really does help me. And if you've got any comments or suggestions for future videos, feel free to comment below. It would be great. Add your comment, add your question, add your suggestion. Without any further delay, let's get started. What I need to do is to try and find some material uh, for my lesson, which is going to be starting soon uh, in five minutes. And here I'm on Lingua House, and this particular student needs support with conversation. And they're from China, so pronunciation's an issue, vocabulary, natural vocabulary is an issue as well. So I'm going to be looking at a variety of different material, uh, and I've got about five minutes, less than five minutes remaining. So fingers crossed. So let's have a look. Um, do, 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 do. Uh, conversation, mastering conversation, everyday numbers, small talk. It's a bit mm, difficult. You know, this student isn't upper intermediate. They're more like intermediate, well, you know, lower intermediate. Discussing things in common is a bit low, so I'm going to go to intermediate here, and uh, English speaking and conversations, 11 lessons. That's interesting. Bit of a course book, so I'm going to download the entire PDF actually. It might help with a variety of things. Yep, looking all good. Um, I've got three minutes remaining. Um, Let's click next. Ah, uh, let's do that. Okay, click next. Not interested. Ah, uh, you know what? Forget it. Um, it's becoming a bit more difficult. Uh, so let's see. Uh, let's just have a look. Sometimes it's just best to look around. Ah, uh, sport, uh, intermediate. I know the student's been doing a bit of working out and that sort of things. Yes, let's go for it. So I'm going to download the worksheets. No listening with this one. Um, and as you can see, there's a variety of things here. Uh, student worksheet. I haven't got this teacher's worksheet yet. There we go. Teacher's worksheet and the student's worksheet. If we open up the student, uh, the teacher's worksheet, you can see here. Um, let's zoom in. Um, a variety of different words and scrambling. That's interesting. Ooh, 
okay, working in pairs, matching, completion, go down, and here it's conversation, yeah, this looks simple enough, I like it. Right, so we're almost there, and we've got a minute to spare, so here we go, let's see how we do, uh, and let's go into his classroom. Okay, I'm just going to wait for the student to turn up. Um, I've muted myself in the classroom and uh, I've switched my camera off. The students here, they may be a little busy, <laughs> you know, let us see. Whilst he's uh, taking his time, I'm going to enjoy a little bit of a cream, what is it, cream, the cram sando. Um, nothing here. Hi there, Ryan. Yeah. <laughs> how are you? Hi, Miss Mighty. Yeah, I'm good. Thanks for asking. So how about you? Yeah, not too bad, thank you. Uh, I'm very well. <laughs> thank you for asking. Yeah. And um, you were working yesterday, yeah? Uh, no, actually, I, I, um, I, I, I just uh, was, I just, I just, just worked uh, yesterday. Um, we just had to change the... We just changed uh, our holidays just for the national days, yeah. Ah, so, so you, you were working yes, yesterday. Yes, I'm, I'm, and today we just um, have a, it's, it's my weekend, so I can have a rest, yeah. Only one day to change, yes. Yes, I see, I see. All right, well, um, and today is your day of rest, yeah? Yes. <laughs> Uh, have you got any plans for today? Um, just want to have a rest uh, at home, yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, how is your um, fitness, um, your workout oh, going? Fitness, yes. Mm -hmm. um, yes, I get, uh, um, get two k kilo, uh, two kilo... <laughs> Mm -hmm. How's that? Mm. You you put on two kilos. Yes, yes. You gained two kilos, yeah. Yes, I just get my weight raised. Yeah, it, your weight um, went up or down? Up, yeah. Uh, I, I, I hope mm. I can be strong, so I hope I hope it can up. Uh, yeah, get up. So Kilo, we say kilogram. kilos. Gram. Yeah, kilos. So kilos. I gained two kilos of weight. Two kilos. Okay. Um, I will put this in the chat so you can see. Yeah. Um, I gained two kilos of weight. Yeah. Can you see it in the, the chat? Just wait a moment. The yeah. internet is a little no. It's a little snow. Okay. Um I haven't get mm -hmm. it. it. Just yeah. No problem. Um, right. Let's see. I'm gonna open up the whiteboard. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mm -hmm. Whoops. And um, I will upload today's activity. Um, so, I thought because you are. Uh, exercising and working out. I thought mm -hmm. we could do a lesson about sports today. Okay, thank yeah? you. Um, but let's wait until it's uploaded. It is still loading. Hmm. This taking just a little bit of time. Sorry. <laughs> It's okay. Mm -hmm. um, so today you're going to have a rest, and um, uh, next week, do you have like a, a national holiday, is it? Or was it last week you had a national holiday? 
last week, yes, we just have a whole week to celebrate、uh, our national holidays.、Yeah. Wow, a whole but, week. But A whole week, yes,、mm. but、uh, it's too. It was too crowded, you know.、Mm. Too busy, yeah. yeah? Yes,、mm. yes. Too many people. Well,、um, mm-hmm. and did you go and see your your parents? Oh my! And、um, I just invite my parents to live with us、mm. um, together. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's good. And what about your son? Was your son happy because he didn't have school?、Mm. Is is still is it still、um, very busy for him? You know,、mm-hmm. yeah.、Um, but the government just want to take steps to、uh, change it. The the government、um, ask all the school、um, counter. Ask his、uh, students to come to school in holidays.、Um, yeah, but、uh, but but it 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 can't、uh, change. Actually, it it can't change anything.、Mm. You know,、um, even the school、um, don't want to、uh, don't ask students come to school to study just in holidays,、mm. but mainly. Um, how to、uh, say many、uh, study center? You know, study center still、uh, open. Yeah, open in holidays. So,、yeah. so, oh, they are very busy. Yeah, yeah. Gosh, even in holidays.、Mm. Because I suppose teachers as well, they don't want to work in in the holiday. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay, right. It's taken a while to upload. Sorry,、um, still uploading. But whilst it is,、uh, can you see the whiteboard? Yeah. I can't say anything. Just, just to see. Just to listen. Okay.、Yeah. Listen. Yeah. Me too. Okay. Gosh, it's taken a while. <laughs> I'll tell you what.、Uh, I'm gonna. I should have done this before.、Um, right. Uh, uh, uh. I'm gonna just close that, and I'm gonna go to Google Drive.、Um, anyway. Um, last week I went to、um, the second largest city in South Korea.、Um, it was very busy because it was、uh, a big festival in the city as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And、uh, in the end,、um, I went for.、Um, three days, two nights. And、uh, I went with my wife and some friends, and it was it was good, good fun,、um, but too busy、yeah. as well. <laughs> good. Yeah. But anyway, right.、Um, I'm going to move our lesson through,、um, and I'll open it up.、Oh. Hmm. <laughs> right. So here's our、mm. our lesson. Can you see that? Okay. Yeah, I can see it. Sport. Excellent. <laughs> Sport. Yeah. And、uh, do you know this 
picture what what that sport is? Yes, um, American football. Yeah, American football. That's right. Um, right. Now, um, if we go down, we got our first question. Um, are you into sport? Which sports do you do or watch? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, are you into sports, Ryan? Uh, into sports, that means um, uh, whether uh, uh, do I like uh, love sport or right? Or good at a spot. It means, uh, do you like sports? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I like sport, but uh, I'm not good at. Uh, um, I'm not good at a spot. Yeah. I see. What what sort of sports are you into? Hmm. Mm. Um, like um, badminton, mm -hmm. uh, table tennis. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I just like uh, sports uh, with skills. You, you know, with skills. So, such as badminton, table tennis, um, like swimming. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, table tennis, badminton, swimming. And mm -hmm. you said um, skills. What what do you mean by skills? Oh, I just means the sport just uh, uh, need uh, skills, not uh, need uh, strong uh, strength, you know, mm. uh, and speed, you know. As just running, I need uh, need speed um, and something need strength. But I think. Badminton and uh, table tennis need uh, skills. Mm, I see. Okay. Mm. Kind of makes sense. Um, right. Um, so, uh, let's see. If we go down a little bit more, we've got a, a few words um, here. We've got like but these words are all mixed um, or, or scrambled. Um, oh, yeah. I just. <laughs> yeah, you Fun. need to a, a yeah. mix. Okay. Okay. <laughs> number three, I know football. Number four, swimming. Uh, uh -huh. Number six, basketball. Uh, Number nine. Mm. Number nine. Uh, B E B A L B A L B A L. Ah, uh, B A L B A L A B E S. <laughs> Any ideas? No. no. So let me share no. this tab instead. And so we got the words here. So no. number one, you're not sure. Number two, or num uh, number three, you said. What, what did you say number three was? Football. Football. Okay. And number four, what did you say? Swimming. Swimming. Okay. Number five. I have no idea now. Not sure. Uh, number six. Basketball. Basketball. Oh, and number five, I know, golf. Uh, number five, golf. Okay. Golf. Uh -huh. uh, number seven. No idea. Okay. Number eight. No idea. No. Number nine. Um, no idea. I, I just... Yes, it's a, it's a kind of ball, but I don't know. Ah, okay. And uh, number ten. Any? 
skiing. Skiing. Okay. All right. So, okay, we've got one, two, three. We've got five. Uh, let me give you the first word. Um, so the first word in this one is A. This first word is C. This one is H. This one, ah, uh, what is this? Uh, <laughs> hmm, not sure of that one. This one is B. Uh, let me have a look. Uh, right. Uh, okay. <laughs> this one starts with B. Um, hockey. Hockey. Number seven. Okay. Okay, great. <laughs> you got it. Okay, good job. Yeah, baseball. Yeah, well done. Uh, okay. Uh, what about number eight? I found it difficult, so you might find it difficult. Four. Box. Box. Boxing. Yeah, that's it. All right. <laughs> Okay, number two is a, a popular sport in England. Um, popular sport in England. Hmm. England. Is 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 it still popular in Asia? Um, not in a well. The nearest is maybe India. Uh, India. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure if it was introduced in Hong Kong, but it's also popular in New Zealand, Australia. Um, yeah, mainly the countries where England colonized over time. Yeah, we, <laughs> where is, yeah, well, I know just the country who, which uh, belonged to Eng England before, mm, right? That's right, yeah. <sighs> A bit like horse racing. In England, horse racing is very popular. But if you go to Hong Kong, I think it is, horse racing is also popular there. I think it's mm -hmm. Hong Kong or Macau. I'm not sure. But anyway. I, I, I have no idea. <laughs> Maybe I don't know the boat. <laughs> okay. Right. Um, okay, this one starts with CR. Cry I C R I Yeah. Uh, <laughs> C R I Clear C R I Cree Cree C C E C I C E T K. Mm -hmm. Kate K T C E K T. Oh C K T. 
I don't know the word. Cricket. Cricket. C K T E. Cricket. 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 T E. Oh, K E T O. Oh. Oh. Actually, I don't know the sport before. Okay, I'll find a picture. I will share a picture of it in a moment. Now, this one starts with A T H. And the、uh, A T H, A T H, A T H. <laughs> Is it popular in in China or in Korea? Um, it's popular around the world. Around the world, okay. A S. Yeah, popular around the world. A T H L E T I C S. That's too just many. Just about running and anything else. Yeah.、Uh, athletics. Yeah. Athletics. 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 So running, marathons,、um, anything to do with like breathing, heavy breathing, athletics or jumping and that sort、mm-hmm. of thing. Yeah. Um, like when you said strength, this is a bit like athletics. You need that strength, yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> right. Let's、uh, find a picture of cricket for you.、Um, cricket、okay. is also an、uh, insect, right? Oh yes, yes. It's an insect as well. <laughs>、uh, yeah.、Um, In my childhood, I like to、uh, to. To take it, yeah, it just、um, to take it. You, you know, it is a very interesting insect. Um,、mm. yeah, um, it is. It's quite a noisy insect sometimes, eh? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So this is cricket. Yeah,、mm-hmm. cricket. Um, but anyway, now, so, uh, sorry. Oh, sorry, is it uh, uh, in Olympic games?、Mm, that's a good question. I'm not sure. Let me have a look. Ah,、uh, um, it's scheduled to be included in the 2028 Summer Olympics in Los Angeles.、Um, Yeah, I, I'm just having a look、um, at the Olympics, so I'll share this tab.、Um, so cricket、uh, is going to be included. India is very happy because it's part of the national sport.、Um, oh. Yeah, and.、Uh, Cricket was part of the 1900 Olympics in Paris with only two teams, one Great Britain and one France. Okay. Yeah, but now because cricket is becoming more popular around the world, I guess it will return、mm-hmm. after 128 years. So you will it will return in 2028. Yeah.、Right. So in four years' time. Okay. Cool. Yeah. So,、um, hmm. Anyway,、um, uh, it's a bit like、um, baseball, you know, baseball like American baseball. Yeah,、But、I know. Cricket is like a. It's、yeah. like a very traditional game.、Um, yeah.、Mm-hmm. Anyway,、uh, right. You 
you know, I said, what sports are you into? Into, and you said badminton, mm -hmm. table tennis. So uh, this thing here, uh, if we say uh, to be into something, what, what does that mean? Mm, just to uh, like or love something. Yeah, to like something. Well, or someone, you could say. Yeah. Oh. Um. And so I can also say uh, being to some, someone. That, that, that you, means you like someone or ah. but you not love someone, right? Mm. Yeah, it's a bit difficult if you say some if you say to someone I'm into her or I'm into him it means that you like them a, a bit more <laughs> like like just like not a lot right uh, it could be uh, okay it's a bit difficult I, I wouldn't say I'm in, well, maybe if you are dating, you can mm -hmm, say, mm -hmm. oh, I'm into her. I like her. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. So be, be, be careful. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so you mentioned here, I like sports for skills. Uh, and you said sports that need skills, not with strength. Um, so... You could say, for example, I'm into sports that um, requires uh, oh, yeah. a special yeah. ability. Of skills. Well, special <laughs> ability, uh, you know, instead of skills. Oh. Okay. You, um, so, badminton needs quick reaction you need to have a good ability of reaction yeah mm -hmm. uh, uh, and you need to be very quick on your feet yeah mm -hmm. um, yeah so sports yeah I into sports that require a special ability um, rather than uh, strength or f let's say physical strength yeah oh physical stress okay. yeah so rather than i'm into something rather than something yeah mm -hmm. um so i could say i'm into jazz music rather than um rock music mm -hmm. yeah so do, do i like rock music ryan uh no 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 i don't yeah yeah um can you make a sentence with i'm into mm, rather than mm? Mm, let me see. Mm, I'm into swimming rather than running. It's too simple, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's simple. Um, yeah. Can you make another sentence? Something more interesting? Okay, let me try. I mean to, um, I mean to helping others rather than being helped, uh, being helped uh -huh. by others, right? <laughs> I'm not sure. Okay, I'm into helping others rather than being helped by others. Yeah, uh, I'm into helping others rather than uh, okay, let me change it slightly. It's a good sentence. It makes sense. Uh, I'm into helping others rather than uh, receiving. Uh, oh, receiving. 
help from others. From yeah. others, yes. It's much better, yeah. Um, uh, oh, and I've, let's remove that. Yeah, rather than receiving help from others. Okay, that's good. Now, um, I'm going to stop sharing here. And if we open up our um, whiteboard, can you see our um, lesson now? Uh, okay, let me see. No, is it is it is? Oh, I can see it now. You can see it now. Yeah, excellent. Mm -hmm. Right. So we've gone through this um, mm -hmm. together. Um, let's have a look at uh, sport here, and we've got different words, um, different sports, different um, equipment, and different places. So we've got sport, equipment, place. And so here we've got a sport like football, which is British English, soccer, which is American English. Equipment is ball, and a place, what would you put for number one? Okay. Um, so which one would you put? Field. Field. Okay. Um, So field, pitch, yeah. All yeah. right. So uh, what I'd like you to do is to have a look at the different words here above, and then you type in below mm -hmm. what you okay. think goes in, yeah? Um, you can use the text tool, yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. Club of course. Uh -huh. A club. A club. And course. Just let it be. Let it. Swimming cap. Um, place. Pool. Boxing. <laughs> so you've changed bat to racket, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Basketball. Skating court bat, okay. Court. Okay. This one golf. Oh, golf. Right, golf. Golf. So the last one. Mm -hmm. All done. 
Let, let me check it. Sure. Change it. Uh, <laughs> number six and the number ten to change it. Yeah. Number uh, six and ten. Okay. 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 Oh. Let's see. So you've put a uh, track down. You got pieced as well. Okay. You're done. So, um, okay. We went through um, number one, we done together. So that's good. Uh, so we got tennis, we got racket, we got court. So that's good. Um, interesting. We have tennis. But we also have badminton, a badminton racket, yeah? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, golf club course. Um, yep, that's very good. So we have the golf club, yeah? Yeah, golf club. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so if you think club, it's like big and, yeah, club. Okay. Yeah. Uh, swimming, cap, <laughs> goggles, swimming, trunks. We also have trunks. Yeah. Swimming trunks. trunks. This is like uh, what you wear, like small shorts, but for swimming. Oh. Yeah. But uh, anyway. Right. Uh, boxing, boxing gloves, and a boxing ring. A ring. That's all good. Right. Uh, motor racing, racing car, racing track, yeah, basketball, uh, yeah, basketball, a ball, a basketball court, that's good, ice skating, skates, rink, nice rink, uh, yeah, ice skates, baseball, baseball bat, skiing, skis, piste, yeah, so very good, well done. Um, do you have any questions about any of this? No. No? Okay. All right. Any new words at all? Sure. Yeah. Okay. All right. P pissed. Ah, uh, pissed. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Pissed. Pissed. Yeah. Um, okay. Right. Now, so uh, let's choose a sport and tell your partner. I'll ask you a partner questions and your partner should try to recall the answers without looking at the table okay so actually let's have a look at um uh badminton uh, can you tell me about badminton the sport the equipment and where you play mm, yeah and uh if you want to play badminton, you need uh, a pair of racket. Um, mm -hmm. A racket, yeah. You need two rackets. A pair of or uh, a pair of uh, no. Two. Okay. You need two rackets. Two rackets and uh, a ball. Do you need a uh, ball, like tennis ball? I, no, uh, badminton. Badminton. Badminton ball. <laughs> That's good. We call it a shuttlecock. Uh, oh, sh shuttlecock. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, shuttlecock. Yeah, I, I just see the word before. Yeah. yeah. Shuttlecock, yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. Easy uh, enough. And where do you play? What's the place? A actually, you can play badminton in any place, actually. But yeah. uh, you'd better to it better to um play it in count uh it's better to play at a court at court okay. at a court yeah um so it's best to play badminton at a court yeah okay okay all right um 
And you mentioned swimming. You're into swimming. So can you tell me a bit more about what you do for swimming? What I should take yeah. to do swimming. Okay. Yeah. A swimming a glasses. Swimming uh, goggles. Goggles. Swimming goggles. Oh, yeah. goggles. Oh, okay, goggles. Yeah. And uh, a swimming cap. Uh-huh. And uh, yeah, I, I actually, I, I know the world uh, tracks. Yes, trunks. actually, it's a new word for me. Trunks. I just uh, tracks. Uh, trunks. Before, trunks. Yeah. Trunks. Before that, I just uh, think that's just to say swimming briefs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I trunks. See. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and uh, it, it's actually is enough. Uh -huh. Right. Yeah, I think so. But you need a swimming pool. Yeah, you can't swim oh, anywhere. Oh yeah, swimming pool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Very good. Uh, let's move on, and we'll go down. And we've got below for number three, matching the people. So we've got different people, and their activities. So, what I'd like you to do is to use the pen tool. Um, to match the people and their activities. Can can you do that for me, Ryan? Okay, let me try. Mm -hmm. Control spots match and to make controls and make decisions. Okay. Control spot and match a spots. Just a T and uh, decide on to do this. Chance, chance a T. Watch a spot. Guan Zhong. Another person or team. Mm. Competing against other people in the race. Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, done, okay. yeah? All right, so uh, could you say the first word for me? Referee. Ah, oh, let's see, so... Referee. 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 Mm, yeah, so slowly, slowly, not, not too quick. Referee. 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 That's it. Okay, very good. That was good. Yeah. Uh, could you say number two for me? Oh, a coach. A coach. Yeah, very good. Good pronunciation. Trains a team, fitness and skills. That's good. Uh, number three? Mar manager. A manager. Yeah, organizes a team, decides on tactics. Um, number four? Captain. Yeah, captain. 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 Yeah. Uh, leads the team on the field or pitch. That's good. Uh, okay. Could you say number five for me? Actually, it's a new word for me. Just the last word. Yes. Yeah, spe mm. Spectator. Yeah, very good. Good pronunciation. Spectator. Spectator. Right. Now, uh, number six. Could you say number six? Uh, opponent. 
Opponent. Opponent. Opponent. Yeah, good. All right. Opponent. And uh, you said plays against another person or team. That's good. And then number seven. Could you say number seven? Competitor. <laughs> uh -huh. Competitor. Mm. Let me come. Com 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 uh, it's a eh sound. Eh. Pet. 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 It's difficult. Yeah. Uh, competitor. Yeah, good. Again. Competitor. Yeah. Competitor. Competitor. No, not potato. No. Com pay. Compare. Pay. Competitor. <laughs> Competitor. A uh, com competitor, competitor, <laughs> competitor. Yeah, very good. Yeah, you got that. It's it's a difficult <laughs> word. Um, yeah, because we have, um, for example, different words in the family. Um, okay, so for example, we have. Compete, competition, compete, compete, competition, competition, competitor. competitor. So the pronunciation just change, you know, right? Yeah. Just first one e, the the second to Compa a. Right. Compete, compete, compete. Yeah. Competitor. So, okay. Why just the same the same word just change its pronunciation? Ah, oh, because it's English. Okay, it's too <laughs> difficult. So it's too difficult for Chinese, right? I know. I, yeah. So it, it's um. You just need to learn. Uh, compete. Mm -hmm. Competition. Compete. Competition. 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 Competitor. Competitor. Yeah, that's it. Okay, we got there. Whew, okay, right. Um, we'll finish off there, um, but then there's a little bit more to do. Um, I'll send you this worksheet so you can review it as well in your mm -hmm. own time. And then maybe in our next lesson, Ryan, we can look at uh, talking about sports in okay. schools, favorite sports, etc. Is that okay? Okay. Yeah. Um, and let me just uh, save today's worksheet. Um, right. Um, do you have any questions at all before we finish off? No, thank you very much. Okay. Right. Uh, you're welcome. And um, I'll see you when it's our next lesson, next Saturday, yeah? Yes. Okay. All right. Well, have a good Sunday, and I'll see you next weekend. You too. Have uh -huh. a good weekend. Right. Bye. Bye-bye. Take care. You too. Okay. So um, that was the lesson. Um, I hope you enjoyed it, and thank you for get in this far in, in the video. Um, I'm just going to share my thoughts and ideas, uh, reflections about how that lesson went. And for me personally, I'm going to look at it in two parts. So things that could be improved upon and things that went well in my perspective. If you have any insights or ideas about what I've done or how I've taught or anything that could be improved upon, feel free to comment. Uh, it'd be great to have your ideas, your thoughts, your um, considerations also. 
So let's get started with the areas that could be improved upon the, the, the slightly less positive aspects. When I started the lesson, I was all prepared. I had my lesson ready to share and I joined the Preply uh, classroom. However, what I failed to do was to find the material well before the class. I had five minutes to spare. Um, I did find a lesson that would connect well with the student about sports, particularly with their background. But I found that the limited time kind of delayed everything particularly uploading the material to the uh, Preply whiteboard and you know I found it quite difficult to to witness that um, you know I was wasting time with the student and I, I felt quite uncomfortable I, I should have got everything ready well before the start of the class um, as any good teacher would um, However, um, I kind of accommodated that and opened up Google Drive and the Google document and started to incorporate some of the answers, ideas there. And in the background, whilst I was going through that with the student, um, I tried to upload the document again. It finally uploaded, <laughs> thank heavens. And I was able to share the lesson with the student eventually, but I think that was like 10, 15 minutes without the, um, without the material. Um, so I would definitely join the classroom a lot earlier than before. Um, I would try and upload the material to the whiteboard before the start of the class to give me plenty of time so I'm not wasting that time having that dead time with the student anyhow um, the positives I found that the student responded very well to the different activities the word unscrambling activity they really enjoyed that I'd not done that with the student before looking at the vocabulary, marking the word stress, getting them to pronounce things correctly. They enjoyed that. And we really focused on the intelligibility, the pronunciation of the student. So I felt that went well. I didn't get to the conversation questions. Um, however, I'll be focusing on that in my next class with the student. So that's my personal thoughts and ideas reflection. So let me know what your thoughts and ideas are, whether your insight is kind of different, whether you see things, whether you agree or disagree with me, I, I don't know. Um, everyone has their own perspective uh, and personal idea about how lessons should be conducted. And it would be great to hear your views, opinions and comments. I'm going to end the video here, so thank you ever so much for getting through not just the introduction and this part of the video, but also the, the live lesson, the recorded lesson. Um, so thank you ever so much for getting through this. I, I really appreciate it. If you've got any questions as well, comment below, subscribe if you haven't already, click that thumbs up, do the thing, you know. Um, but yeah. Have a lovely week. Thanks for watching and happy teaching. Bye bye.